Yeah, so it was in the, I don't remember exactly what time, but it was sometime in the morning, and I was working at this home, and I, and I, uh, I was doing gardening work, and uh, <clears throat> it was, um, this little lady came out and just told me, she said, Harry, there's a, uh, the Japanese had attacked Pearl Harbor. And so I said, oh, is that right? And then, uh, as I remember, I kept working, and then she went in and came out again, uh, maybe 10, 15 minutes later, and said that the Japanese had attacked uh, Pearl Harbor, and it was uh, very serious. So I said, well, where's Pearl Harbor? She said, oh, that's in Hawaii, in Honolulu. And that, uh, and at that time, I, maybe she said more, but she suggested I go home. And I said, why? I said, I haven't finished working. She said, well, since the, the Japanese have attacked Pearl Harbor, I don't, we don't want you to stay here any longer. So I said, well, I haven't finished my work yet. She said, well, that's okay. I'll, we'll pay you for what you've done. And that, I left then. And it kind of bothered me because I had been working there. They were very nice people, uh, elderly couple. But um, <coughs> uh, I guess when they ha when they heard that news, she didn't make any distinction between the fact that I was Japanese American. She just associated me with the, with Japan, and uh, and that was expressed how they felt. <coughs> 